Next block is L2. L2 has been modified and it's been simplified to eliminate these little rectangle pieces so that it's easier to English paper piece. So we're gonna be working from this diagram in the book and what's gonna happen with assembly is we are going to assemble this like a nine patch block. So if you turn this this way, it's easier to see. So I have these squares, I'm gonna assemble these squares, I'm gonna attach the triangles and then so I'm gonna have nine units of the same size and then I'm just gonna assemble this like a nine patch block. I'm gonna make a row, make a row, make a row, connect the rows, add the triangles. So from that standpoint, it's a simple assembly. I have my pieces laid out on my box. So from a basting standpoint, I am going to baste the long sides first on these little double arrow pieces and then the, uh, the points. I'm going to baste the um, legs of the triangle first so that this the tags go away from this center. So that will help me assemble it better. And I'm going to do that on all of these. It's going to be the legs and then I have hot So all the tags are going to go away into these solid squares. Squares I'm going to baste opposite sides and then opposite sides. And then this triangles I'm going to also baste with the legs and then the hypotenuse to make the tags go away from the center. So I will get started with basting and assembling my little um, arrow triangle pieces. So I've got my pieces basted. I decided to baste the tip before the sides because it gives me a sharper edge on these obtuse triangles. And so I've got these basted with the tags facing away from the little double arrow section. So I'm going to assemble these units and then I can baste my squares. Okay, so I've got all my little square pieces assembled. So I'm just gonna base these squares and then make my nine patch. So I basted all my squares and I've got two of my three rows all put together and my flowers go in the same direction. Oops. And my flowers go all in the same direction here and they're the same direction as that. So I'm going to finish the third row and then I can put the center together. So I've put my nine patch center together and all of my fabrics going in the right direction. So now it's just a matter of attaching the corners. So I've attached opposite corners to the center part and now it's just a matter of attaching the other two. So I've attached the other two triangles on the corners and now I have a completed L2 block.